Hi guys, here we are, Hard Rock Low Sky Boats. We are currently in the Octave building, room number 1305, which is the first floor, section three, Octave building. We are now walking towards the lobby. We will show you everything you need to know about Hard Rock Low Sky Boats. We're entering the lobby now. First place on your left is Awaken Your Senses. It's $175 per person. We might try it out later. Seems to be pretty interesting, but probably more a gimmick to get your money than anything else. Over here on this side is the main pool section, which we will show you later. Right now there's a lot of memorabilia of music. Over here on the left is the main auditorium, mostly for meetings, conferences. So this is our third day here now, so we're pretty much familiar with everything. And we will show you everything you need to know. On the left here is a lot of memorabilia, music, the history of Hard Rock, which we will come back later. We're now going back with the time. But later on, we will come back the other way and show you the Hard Rock order. The history of Hard Rock. And this one is my famous girlfriend, Madame. mark at the end. And all these guitars here actually belong to people. We donated them. Uh, these musicians donated, donated these guitars to Hard Rock. Well, at least that's what they say, so I don't know. Cyrus donated the guitar. So we are here on the other side of the building now, the other side of the lobby. This is the Zen restaurant, the Asian restaurant, where they have kibachi and sushi. And we're going to try that tonight, and we'll give you a review of that later on. There's bowling here from 3 to 11. It is not included. I don't know what the charges are, but you can try your hand at bowling if you like. Alex Van Halen's drums, quote unquote. Here's another shop down on this side of the end. Down here to the left is the gym. 
we'll go in and take a quick look. We come here every day in the morning. It's, it has pretty good equipment, we'll show you. Pretty popular, a lot of people are here. Escapology, which I'm not sure what it is. So. And I think you don't ask them what this is. Hello, what is escapology? Huh? What is this? It's an escape room. Escape room. Uh, can you tell me about it? It's a game. Game. Game, yeah. Maybe it's a puzzle. It's a puzzle. It's a puzzle. <laughs> you can ask them. You have a, a history you need to find a way to get out. Oh, okay. I see. It's like a game. You go in and try to find your way out. Exactly. Okay. Can you charge? Okay. Maybe it's $45 for the first. Okay. Alright, maybe I'll try it later. Yeah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. On the pricey side, but hey, you're on vacation, so work hard, play hard. Alright, so let's, uh, let's go back out and hit the pool areas. The other way toward the lobby here is the. There are some shops here. Again, on the pike side, but it is what it is. As you can see on the walls, there's a lot of memorabilia, pictures of musicians, stars, young and old. Good morning. 
Captain Marvel. See how the front looks like. Take, take you around. I'll show you how the scenery is. At first, we'll go to the right and show you the famous Hard Rock Los Cabo sign. Love all, serve all. up there just so everyone knows this resort is about three or four years old it's relatively new but it's far away from Medano Beach it's pretty much in the midst of nowhere but it doesn't matter because everything you need is here Existence, so you know the history of all the cafes and hotels. And then after that, we'll go down to the pool. 1971, Hard Rock opens its first cafe in London. 1977, they become incorporated. Nineteen eighty-four, they go international. They open their first location in New York City. They open another one in Dallas in 1986, 1988. 25th Hotel in Montreal, Canada. And again, famous Madonna. Nineteen ninety six. Nineteen ninety eight, the open valley, sheer waters. One hundred Hard Rock in Amsterdam, nineteen ninety nine. Twenty oh four, the open in Tampa. New York City. 2007, Florida. 2009, Malaysia. Shakira, New York in 2012. 2011, Dominican Republic. 2012, Puerto Vallarta. 2014, Riviera Maya. 2016, Miami Dolphins. 
Five years old. My correction. The beach will start at the right side of the beach. We'll work with us. big open area where parties could be held, events could be held. We're gonna make a right, we're gonna go down to that pool area. And this pool is called a legendary pool. The legendary pool is only for legendary members or if you're a palace premier member, you can come here as well. Members only, non-members are not allowed. This pool is pretty windy. It's pretty windy today, but even if it wasn't, it's totally exposed to the elements of this a windy day. You will get all of the wind. It's pretty quiet here. Yes, there's not a lot of numbers. Plus, today's a windy day. Just take a quick look around. Show you what it looks like. down there. In the U.S. you have red flag meaning no swimming. Here you have black flags meaning you go in, you're dead. Swim up bar. Make sure you can swim. 
10 a.m. So I can't start early. everyone allowed to, to go into this pool. The beach is very wide, as you can see. There's a lot of vendors on the beach. We haven't been there yet, but I would imagine that they're pretty aggressive. Once you step on the beach, they'll wave you over and ask you to buy something. So here on this side, it's Pool side. In the distance, you see the, the water park for kids or adults. Here's one of the pools here by on the beach, swimmer park, alcohol flowing everywhere. overlooking the pool, which I would imagine is pretty noisy at all times of the day. There are what you would think are swings, but they're coming up sort of, but not really because they're not allowed to swing in them. You know, set and hang out in the shade. It sort of makes sense because you have to actually walk into the water to get to them. Members, non-members. But how do you know? 
Yeah, this is how you know a member. A member has these gray bands. <laughs> A lot of yellow bands, some pink bands, some green bands, some black bands. And that's how you know everyone's status. And that's how the workers know everyone's status. And they will treat members better than non members. These cabanas are for rent. If it takes that soon, uh, so if you're not a VIP member, you would have to pay uh, like $50 a day. If you have a family, they would be worth it, but if you're just a couple, music in the main pool. Looks like we have a band tonight. Maybe even give a lunch. We'll come back. So here's the water park. Here's the adults. We're going to spend today at, which is less windy. It's called the Eden Pool. The Eden Pool is for members only, also, but it's for families. So, if you got a family and you're a member, you can go there. Right next to the Eden Pool is what they call the Red Pool, the famous 
one and only bloody red pool. Anyone ever seen a red pool? pool? It's like someone spilled bloody margarita or something. So here we're going up the steps to the Eden pool. Let's see if any if anyone has come by yet. Eden pool. Families. have the waking eye senses.